Welcome to this video. Today I'm going to talk about creation of corner brace with Tiffana. Um, it, it will be a sheet metal part uh, with constant thickness. So um, I will be using for this part design workbench in FreeCAD. So let's start with part design workbench. We'll be working only with this part design workbench here. And let's go to model. And in the tree, let's create a body. Click create a body. Here you will get the coordinate system and the empty body. So here in a body, let's create a primitive. At primitive, it will be a box. And let's just increase this box to second time. For example, you can just change here value, for example, 20. But if you want, uh, you can just multiply your value, for example, uh, by 2. Press. And if you will press OK, you will get. Uh, your values 20 20 20 so um, after that when we have this box uh, the first step will be creation of Stefana uh, profile um, to, we will create the 2d sketch of the Stefana here uh, and the angle uh, we have uh, create the plane uh, with uh, 45 degree for this surface and this surface and for, on this plan we will create a sketch for so uh, we will be using the create a datum plan tool and now we have to make a reference for this I will be using this edge I will choose this edge and we have this uh, this um, condition that we have the line uh, and we will set the datum plan like a normal to edge this edge and uh, the second uh, step we will uh, just make a rotation of this plan let's make rotation in some direction the first direction will be this it, I will set 90 we can look how position looks now. I will go to edit datum again. And now we have to change the position in this direction. I will set 45. Press enter and I will get this um, angle between surface and datum plan 45 degrees. So uh, let's go to orthographic view. It's my um, settings. I use a perspective view and also I will use the orthographic view here. So, so for this visualization, we will uh, check it that we have the right position of a datum plan. And after that, let's go to this front view um, and we will use this uh, viewing for this part and on datum plan let's create a sketch I go to sketch and here let's create a rectangle using the central point with this rectangle here Pr uh, press escape and now, how can you see, we can to change the position of central point in this direction of axis. And uh, I want to set a symmetry for this central point between this edge of box and this edge. For this uh, purpose, I will export this line to a sketch. We will choose just uh, this uh, tool, click to edge on a model and this edge uh, will be exported to sketch press escape 
let's go to this view and let's choose one by one this point this and last one will be this central point of a rectangle let's use this to three points uh, let's set this constraint symmetrical and now we if you will click left mouse and try to change the position of point you cannot because you have the constraint symmetry here but you can change the uh, parameter of a box uh, so let's set this uh, dimension for this uh, width of profile uh, stefana let's set the distance and I will set 4 millimeters and after that let's set some big uh, position for this rectangle it doesn't matter like a big it will be and because we the next step we will perform the pocket operation we will cut some material from this box Let's hide the datum plan using space button on keyboard. And let's choose the sketch and make a pocket operation here. I will, if you will increase this uh, length of the pocket, you will increase um, your stiffener corner. Okay, I will set, for example, seven millimeters. 7 millimeters length and now we have a stiffener um, here and after that let's choose this and this edge using control hold down um, hold down uh, control uh, button on keyboard and let's create a field operation here I will set one millimeters, press OK. And now we have got your stiffness. And let's create a sheet metal thickness for this um, corner brace. And for this purpose, we have to choose these external faces. You can choose it using a control but hold down control button on keyboard and choose all these external faces. It will be four faces without this, uh, any faces from he here, from this view. And after that, let's click the thickness tool in menu. And if you will increase this uh, value of thickness you can see that we have but uh, if you will increase it more than one millimeter you will get the false because uh, there's some um, condition for this uh, field is not re is required so we will decrease it to 0 0.5 millimeters and here we can also add these all faces manually using this tool add or remove faces and after that let's press ok and now we have the corner brace rest tiffana here also uh, it has one or 0.5 millimeter thickness and the last operation let's uh, add holes to plate let's choose the face and create a sketch on face and after that let's create a circle and let's set a position for this circle uh, I want to set the distance between this edge of corner brace and this point I will export the edge from 3D model and after that I will choose these two points and want to set the horizontal distance between them I will set four millimeters and after that I want to set this uh, vertical position let's set vertical position let's set for example 70 maybe 60 millimeters 
Okay, it looks good. And let's create the second uh, circle in random position on the plate. And let's repeat uh, these uh, dimensions for this circle. But choose this uh, axis line, this point, set the horizontal dimension, 4 millimeters also. And let's set the vertical position between two points, also 16 millimeters. And after, cho after that, let's choose these two circles. I will use the control, hold down control and click left mouse for these two circles. And let's set the radius constraint. It will automatically set the equal condition and means that if you will change, for example, the radius, it will change also for this circle here. Let's set one millimeters radius, press close sketch and use this sketch. Let's make a pocket operation. Uh, five millimeter will be enough. Press OK. And we have here uh, a corner brace with the holes here on this plate. But uh, if we want to create the holes uh, for this plate, we can to go through two different ways. Uh, the first way will be repeat this all previous steps for this plate, create sketcher, create circles, create holes, but uh, you can uh, make easy it easy to second way it will be using the mirrored uh, operation from menu it means that we have to mirror these two uh, holes to this plate uh, but uh, now we have to create a plate symmetry plate for this operation mirror because we don't have it here so uh, for this, uh, let's create one else datum plan. Uh, let's uh, set the right position for this datum plan. You can just, um, for example, choose this uh, edge, but I want to link our datum plan with, for example, this surface. And we just to have create a perpendicular datum plan to this surface. It means we have to make a rotation of the surface in some axis direction. Let's check which direction. It will be x direction. I will set 90 degrees. Press OK and you will get the right position for your datum plan here. And now we can use this datum plan for creation and mirror operation for these two pocket uh, things. So let's choose these pockets, make a mirror, and let's choose the plane for mirror. Let's select reference, choose this datum plan, and you will get your symmetry mirrored um, holes for this plate also. Press OK. Let's hide the datum plan space using space button. Press it. And you will get uh, the finished model of corner brace with stiffener. We have the stiffener. We have a constant uh, thickness for this model. Uh, so um, this is a finish of uh, creation of this 3D model. Uh, thank you for watching, subscribe to the channel, uh, goodbye.